So it's the night before the trip, getting ready to pack for Aspen. I finally figured out my outfits and all that jazz. Everything is just kind of just thrown across the bed. I finally got to sort through my clothes and fold them up. I brought tons of sweaters and only three pairs of shoes. I, I really minimized the amount of clothes and the amount of things I wanted to bring because I was only staying a few days. So I packed the majority of my heavier items in my larger bag and then my electronics and some spare clothes and things that I really, really needed um, in my carry-on. They're getting ready to board here in about 15 minutes and then it's off to Dallas because I do have a layover in Dallas and then from Dallas I fly to Aspen. In Dallas, um, waiting to board the flight to Aspen. I'm excited. I can't wait to see what it's going to be like in Aspen. It's supposed to be snowing already. So I suppose it'll be, actually should be snowing when I get there. I don't know if I got enough on, but I mean it's too late now. It's too late now. Okay guys, so I just made it into the place that we are staying in. It's like an apartment. I think it's an apartment. I don't know if it's a house or, or whatever, but I absolutely love it. It's that cabin-y feel that I wanted. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. Just give you a little glimpse. We rented it Airbnb. So this is the kitchen and I love like the wood on top, the wooded ceiling. I like that a lot. It has that cabinish y feel, even though it's not like full on cabin, which is fine, but it's like still modern. This is the living room. This is like the little desk area. Put my bag there. Have a TV, have a fireplace. I'm getting ready to light that. I am literally freezing right now. It's so cold. Like my nose is running. I did turn on the heater, but I don't know if it's working. Or if it's kicked in but so here are the stairs and there's only two rooms up here it's really small hey outfit of the day they have an um, upstairs balcony here's the view it's so beautiful and it's snowing you can see the snow falling here's the room that i'm gonna be staying in really simple which is fine with me i really like the place it's very homey so i honestly need to do my makeup but i'm feeling so tired i stayed up really late last night packing whoo i only got like two hours of sleep snowing guys and this is amazing it's the most wonderful time of the year it's dreaming of a white christmas and i got it the mountains oh i love it it's so beautiful oh my gosh i've never seen anything like this oh my gosh just seeing the snow so puffy a couple of hours later my friend arrived and we got dressed for dinner this is my little dinner outfit we kind of viewed the little neighborhood we were in and then headed out to get food mm, so hot, we hot. just got to some food because we haven't ate all day and we're gonna stop by the grocery store after this but we're at Thai restaurant, Bangkok Vegan Lover Menu, and we're gonna eat some Thai food. Yay! I'm excited. I am excited too. First meal. First meal. So I'm like terribly hungry. I ordered appetizer, and I had two of these little tofu things and some sauce. All right, guys, my food is finally here. Um, what is this called, Tova? This is red curry with tofu and veggie. It's so good. I ordered some soup, but that wasn't what I really wanted. It was not going to hit the... Mm -hmm. And it took forever for them to get it out here, and I was like extremely hungry. So when her food came out, I was like, this is what I wanted. This is kind of like a misunderstanding with the menu. We got it figured out. So now I'm getting ready to eat. Okay, guys, so we just finished dinner. Look at the snow. It just doesn't even look real. It doesn't even look real. Look at the trees. They look fake. It's so beautiful. It just, it's surreal. It's a little Christmas shop here. It's a nice little shopping area. We're getting ready to go to the grocery store. 
Get some water and some stuff, some snack Clark's Market. Shortly after grabbing what we needed at the grocery store, we walked the town a bit more and visited a couple more shops just to get the feel of the city. It's the next day, second day in Aspen, and we're walking to the gondola. We're gonna ride that and then go get some food. Almost two o'clock and we're just now moving. But, oh well, Let's show you the view. Look at that. Just look at the, oh, it's almost one o'clock? Yeah. I'm on Houston time. I don't know why am I, okay, so it's one o'clock. Yeah. So it's not as bad. Uh, <laughs> look at that, oh how God. pretty it is. Like you want a picture with a beautiful background, Tony. Okay, so we're getting ready to go on the gondola. My hat looks cricket. Is my hat cricket? Oh, hold on. I feel like it's gonna fall off. Oh, that looks better. It's so cute. <laughs> yeah, it's better. Right. Okay, thanks. Okay, so we're getting ready to go on the gondola. I'm excited. So we just got our tickets, and now we're walking up. Woo! So we're on the gondola. <laughs> I'm excited. Oh my god. Heck yeah. Oh, this is so awesome. Wow. <laughs> Look at the view. I wish I could ski. I feel like I'm missing out. Like. Oh my goodness. some tofu um, and a salad so keeping it simple and I added avocado and I got me some apple chips to snack on for some pizza. This view guys is so crazy. Marvelous. Yes. Spectacular. <laughs> we're getting ready to leave here and then we're gonna go visit the Maroon Bells. Wish I could just do I'm it. glad I we came here. I yeah. Like if they had stuff you could rent, it'd be different. Yeah, because like the like, clothes. Because yeah. skiing alone, how much was 150 Yeah. Yeah. Just for a day. Partial day was 99 so. Yeah. I doubt we'd spend the whole day. $100, yeah. After leaving the gondola, we took the city shuttle to view the city. And we also took a shuttle up through the mountains to get a better view and just to see how people are living in the mountains. It's just so awesome. Just ate dinner and we're at Bamboo Bear. It's Bamboo Bear, right? Mm -hmm. Bamboo Bear here in Aspen. I know that like the wall is green. Looks like I'm on like I'm sitting in front of a green screen. <laughs> but I just ate I forgot to vlog my food. I got um I don't even know, some phone up. No, it wasn't pho. I forgot what I got. I just got some grilled vegetables, some tofu. It was a Korean rice bowl. We did map. You said Korean, it. Korean rice bowl? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I got a Korean rice bowl and I went really light on the rice, had some vegetables in there like bok choy, carrots, I don't know, spinach. It's my empty bowl with my little dirty napkins and it has some kind of ginger sauce. So that was dinner for tonight. So the people here are amazing. They're so amazingly nice. It's crazy. Like this, this, the town is beautiful. Drop dead gorgeous, and the people here are just so welcoming and so friendly and polite. It's just awesome. Like to go somewhere and have people welcome you in their city and be all open to talk to you about it authentically and organically, and even offer even more like tips and where to eat and all that stuff. Everybody has just been like so generous. So that's what me and my my friend were talking about like how polite everybody is. Hey guys, so it's day three in Aspen and we're going to be going to 
Glenwood Hot Springs and we're taking the bus. We're on the bus and we're getting ready to leave. It's gonna be like an hour, 10 minutes till we get there because this bus takes stops. It's like 30 something stops so we're riding the AO. Um, we missed our bus this morning. We're supposed to leave at 8 a.m. this morning to get to Glenwood Hot Springs at 9. But we overslept. It's okay. We're still going. So that bus we would have took earlier would have been like 50 minutes from now. Taking this one, it's like extra 20. So I'm excited to be in those hot springs. Looking at a beautiful, a beautiful view. Walking to Hot Springs. We're crossing the Colorado River right now and we'll be there shortly. I'm excited. Tell me you're excited. She's so excited. <laughs> <Can't> we're <laughs> Colorado River. We're headed to the Hot Springs. The view Woo is beautiful. Woo! So pretty. Oh, it's Christmas time. Feel sad I can't help it Got you on my mind I don't know how to call this We're finally eating and it's like 10 What's it 10? It's 2.37 And we still actually haven't ate but we're just now eating a late lunch And we're at an Indian place here in Glenwood, Colorado I ordered, I don't know what I ordered I don't know Chick kind of felt dish. a chickpea dish, yeah, and some naan. <laughs> All right, here's my food. We have a rice, naan, and I got chick chickpea masala. It's vegan, so this is lunch. And the name of the restaurant is what is masala, masala and curry. curry. Masala and curry in Glenwood. back in town we're back in Aspen and we just stopped by a bakery paradise bakery this place is awesome they have so many vegan options oh my gosh I would be a I would just be too kind to myself <laughs> but I live down here every day it's Tuesday but they had like a snickerdoodle cookie a lemon cookie oatmeal cookie mm -hmm. oh I got some of so uh, they had like three different muffins that were vegan it was another cookie let me look a ginger molasses cookie never heard of that um they're all vegan and they had like three different muffins they just had a ton of vegan options which is always uh, a breath of fresh air because not all places have options doesn't have to be totally vegan but just have some options for like everybody which is nice so okay we're gonna go to the art museum check that out and then i guess grab a drink later so i'm eating a lemon cookie one of the lemon cookie well a lemon cookie a vegan lemon cookie let me get that right mm -hmm. from paradise bakery it's pretty good i tried the ginger molasses cookie i didn't really like it <laughs> with this lemon zest cookie is good oh yeah so from the bakery we walked our way over to the city museum and checked it out and they had some really cool pieces and some really cool rooms they also had a nice cafe on the third floor is a rooftop cafe and a beautiful view on the rooftop look at the view guys this view is uh, unreal. Unreal. It's melting your drink. Then it makes it watery. Yeah, exactly. Last night, guys, we were at Hotel Jerome. Day bar. Day bar. Having some drinks. This is the lobby area. Look at it. It's so freaking nice. Look at this place. It's crazy. Okay, so we just left Hotel Jerome and now we're at a bar called Hooch and after Hooch we're gonna head our way over to a bar called Red Onion. Is it Red Onion Creek or just Red Onion? Red Onion. Red Onion. So here we are. Are they even open? Hey, is this the entrance? Oh, here we go. Yeah, it's a really cool spot. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay, so we're on our way to Red Onion. We're yep. leaving what well, we just left already. <laughs> Hooch. Hooch was pretty cool. It's cool. It's cool. City lights of Aspen. This is ridiculous. It is so pretty. It's crazy. Where is this music coming from? I know, right? So, I don't know. It I sounds lit. Yeah, sounds lit. Right All right, we are at B Red Onion. Getting ready to walk in right now. These two lit trees. So pretty. This is our guidance home. So I'm waiting at the airport. My flight has been delayed. So I don't really know what time it's leaving, but just waiting to see when it is. And I don't know when I'm gonna get back to Houston. It'll probably really be blah, blah, blah. It'll probably be, actually no, probably. It's, it's gonna be really late tonight. So that's what it's looking like, but it's okay. Just as long as I make it back today. I, know, I thought about staying another night and just taking the same flight tomorrow, but I'm not. So, just sitting here waiting. Finally made the flight. Getting ready to go home. i to take off in a little bit. But look at that view of the airport. It's so cute. It's like the smallest airport ever, but it's awesome. I love it. Hey guys. So I finally made it home. It is after 10 o'clock p.m. And I'm finally home. It feels so good. <sighs> so I enjoyed Aspen. But I'm also happy to be home. And yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Comment what you like down below. And I love you. See you next video.